At first glance, a muddy landscape appears as a monochrome and challenging environment, a sticky, nutrient-rich soup that seems more like an obstacle than a resource. Yet, for a diverse array of animals, this very muck is the key to survival and prosperity. This is the great mud mystery. How do creatures, from the mightiest elephant to the smallest insect, not just endure, but actively thrive in these sodden realms? The answer lies not in a single secret. White tigers are extremely rare in the wild. Most white tigers alive today are in captivity, mainly bred for zoos or entertainment. White tigers in captivity are inbred to preserve the white coat. This often leads to genetic defects such as crossed eyes, cleft palates, scoliosis, and shortened limbs. Leopards are highly adaptable and can live in forests, mountains, grasslands, and even deserts. Leopards are mostly solitary and territorial animals. They are primarily active at night, nocturnal, hunting and patrolling their territory. Leopards often drag their prey up into trees to keep it safe from scavengers like hyenas. Leopards eat a wide range of animals' deer, Lions are carnivores and apex predators. They mainly eat large animals like zebras, wildebeest, and buffalo. Lions are classified as vulnerable by the IUCN due to habitat loss, human-wildlife conflict, and poaching. Lions are the only truly social cats. They live in groups called prides. A pride usually consists of related females, their offspring, and one, three adult males. Goats were among the first animals to be domesticated over 10,000 years ago in the Middle East. Goats are strictly herbivores. They eat grass, leaves, shrubs, bark, and weeds, but not trash, despite the myth. Goats have horizontal rectangular pupils. This gives them wide peripheral vision to spot predators. Goats are ruminants. They chew cud to help digest tough plant material in a four-chambered stomach. Moose are strong swimmers and can swim up to six miles, 10 kilometers, without stopping. They can even dive up to 20 feet, 6M, underwater to feed. Moose are often found near lakes, rivers, and wetlands where they can access aquatic plants and cool off. Moose can be very dangerous, especially if threatened or during rutting season. Collisions with vehicles are a serious concern due to their size and height. Moose are strong swimmers and can swim up to six miles, 10 kilometers, without stopping. Tigers are the largest cats in the world. A male Siberian tiger can weigh over 600 pounds, 270 kilograms, and grow up to 10 feet, 3 meters, long with tail. Tigers are mostly nocturnal. Their eyes are specially adapted for night vision. They can see six times better than humans in the dark. Tigers are endangered due to poaching and habitat loss. Only around 4,000 tigers are left in the wild. Tigers love water and are excellent swimmers, unlike most cats.
A bull is an intact, not castrated, adult male of the species Bostarus, domestic cattle. Castrated males are called steers. Bulls are larger, heavier, and more muscular than cows or steers. Some breeds can weigh over 2,000 pounds, 900 kilograms. Bulls are colorblind to red. It's the movement of the matador's cape in bullfighting that triggers a reaction. Cheetahs are the fastest animals on land. They can run up to 70 miles per hour, 113 kilometers per h in short bursts. Cheetahs have long legs, a slim body, and a long tail that acts like a rudder to help them turn quickly while chasing prey. Cheetahs can only run at full speed for about 20 to 30 seconds. After that, they need to rest. Running that fast takes a lot of energy. Cheetahs are in danger. There are only about 7,000 cheetahs left in the wild today. Donkeys have excellent memories they can recognize places, and other donkeys they haven't seen in years. Donkeys can carry up to 30% of their body weight and pull even more they've been used as pack animals for centuries. Donkeys form strong bonds with other donkeys, animals, or humans. Lonely donkeys can become sad or depressed. Donkeys are highly intelligent, not stubborn. They're just careful and cautious by nature. Sheep have amazing memories. They can recognize faces of other sheep and even humans and remember them for years. Sheep are very social animals and like to stay in groups. They often follow the leader. That's where the phrase follow like sheep comes from. Sheep say ba to communicate with each other. Lambs and their mothers can recognize each other by their unique sounds. Sheep grow thick wool that keeps them warm. Their wool is used to make clothes, blankets, and socks. Sheep have amazing memories. They can recognize faces of other sheep and even humans and remember them for years. Sheep are very social animals and like to stay in groups. Frogs are found on every continent except Antarctica in nearly every kind of environment from rainforests to deserts. Frog croaks are like nature's dating profiles. Some can be heard from miles away. Frogs in North America can survive being frozen solid during winter. Their bodies produce a natural antifreeze that protects their organs. Not all frogs lay eggs in water. Frogs are found on every continent except Antarctica, in nearly every kind of environment from rainforests to deserts. Frog croaks are like nature's dating profiles. Some can be heard from miles away. Frogs in North America can survive being frozen solid during winter. Alligators can grow up to 11, 15 feet. 3.4, 4.6 meter, and weigh over 1,000 pounds, 450 kilogram. Their bite force is around 2,000, 125 size strong enough to crush bones. Alligators are ectothermic, cold-blooded, and rely on the sun to regulate body temperature. In cold weather, they enter brumation, a hibernation-like state. Alligators have existed for over 37 million years outliving dinosaurs. They are closely related to crocodiles, but differ in snout shape.
situations where mud functions as a versatile tool, a sanctuary, a pantry, and a pharmacy, all rolled into one. For both plant eaters and meat eaters, the seemingly humble mud pit is a cornerstone of life, offering unique solutions to the universal challenges of thermoregulation, 